Boat Song has drawn the pole position and will move in behind the championship pair of Tommy Berry and Pronto Don for the final parade. Here they are, the only survivors from an original Hamiltonian nomination list of 489. And in a few minutes, one of these will fall to the wayside. Here they come now, and they're off. Simpson elects to go to the front with Hickory Smoke, and Baldwin and Hootsaw offer no resistance. This race-off will be a battle of driving strategy as well as a test of each man's and horse's ability. The early pace will be assuredly moderate, as it is now, but at some later stage, probably somewhere between the halfway point and the top of the stretch, Baldwin will shake the lines at Hootsong, and she will come out after the leader. And then, two of the finest young trotters the sport has known in a long while will battle it out head and head for the highest honors harness racing can bestow. Victory in the Hamiltonian. The first quarter time was 34 and two fifths. Racing down the back stretch now, it's Hickory Smoke, Johnny Simpson up by a length. Boot song with Ralph Baldwin up right in behind. And Simpson is looking for his first Hamiltonian victory as he races Hickory Smoke right down to the halfway mark. Boot song right in, ready to challenge. And of course the drivers could challenge at any point in the mile, but usually they'll wait until right around this turn. One eight and three fifths was the halftime, and Hootsong could now come out at any moment, or Baldwin might elect to wait until the three quarter. We'll see. Here's Hickory Smoke in the turn now. Hootsong is right there as they come in. Baldwin is not going to wait. He's out now. He's moving with Hootsong. Hickory Smoke's on the inside, and Simpson shakes Hickory Smoke up. Here comes Hootsong. They're racing head and head now in that far turn. Gets Hickory Smoke around the turn as they come to the three quarters. Hootsong on the outside, and they're head and head now. They're neck and neck. Hickory Smoke and Hootsong for the Hamiltonian. Which one will it be? Hickory Smoke's on the inside. Hootsong's on the outside. As they come down by the eighth mile pole, it's Hickory Smoke and Hootsong. Either one of them could do it. It's Hickory Smoke on the inside. He seems to be stronger at this point. Hootsong, however, is right there trying to come on. It's Hickory Smoke and Hootsong. Hickory Smoke seems to be getting it all now as they come for the wire, and it's Hickory Smoke. The time was a moderate two eight and four fifth, but the last half was in one minute and a fifth, and the final quarter in a sizzling 28 and three fifths, as Hickory Smoke, with a great display of speed, manners, and gameness, proves his right to be rated on a par with other great Hamiltonian winners. The Hamiltonian Trophy is held by Lawrence Shepard as he and Hickory Smoke flank Simpson in the winner's circle. Mrs. Simpson, co-owner Archie Mudd, Illinois Governor Stratton, and Grand Circuit President Octave Blake join in the festivities. Gene Hayes steps into view at the right, and caretaker Ike Hill at the left, as Ducoin winds up its most memorable afternoon.